already I'm sorry Laura anyway let's go we can talk about this later this is no place for a kid there are all sorts of strange things around here I can't believe you haven't even gotten a scratch on you why should I Later, okay? But it's really important. What is it? A letter from Mary. Huh? I want to go get it. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. The lighting is so good. Come on, hurry up. Is it in there? What are you doing, Laura? It's further back, in the desk. James, why are you so dumb? Laura! What are you doing? Ha ha, I tricked you. Open the door, Laura. Why should I? I'm a liar, right? Want me to open it? Huh? Huh? Do ya? What's the magic word? Laura? Okay. I guess it won't open it. I think I'll just leave you like this. You snotty little brat! Open up! Why? You... You... Laura? You fucking... Should have just said please. Bad things happen to people who are mean to kids. I'm telling you. Another one? Forgot how many of these there were.
Wasted some bullets there, but I'm not worried about it. Now we're in the hospital other world. Or uh, the hospital alternate, as it is technically called. So this is the first time, uh, it's... This is the first time we've been here, uh, in, in Silent Hill 2. And it's a bit different from the one in, in Silent Hill 1. It's not the same other world, if you will. Oh, and if you have a problem with me calling it the other world, um, I really don't care. <laughs> like, you could literally just call it the alternate world, or hospital alternate, or just alternate whatever. I really do not care. I don't think it makes any difference what you call it. Oh, see? Loading screen. Did it break the immersion? Did it last more than one second? No. The answer to both is no. There's a piece of paper on the bed. I was locked up inside the basement's basement. It was so small and dark, and I was so afraid. I dropped my precious ring, but I will never, ever go back there. I got a dry cell battery. Basement storeroom key. Part of the wallpaper is torn. I can see something drawn on the wall beneath. Are those hands searching for something? Or are they just a sign of pain? That's so deep. James.
nothing important in the room. I think we might have used more bullets than we got. Yep. And a health drink as well. There's something that looks like a refrigerator. Will you open it? Hmm. He's too weak. It's no good. The door is too heavy to open by myself. You know, I would assume that you could get it open a little bit, though. The way he was pulling, it seemed like it was completely locked. So something about the, um, I mentioned before, uh, one of the directors of the remake claiming that, uh, fans will be able to explore a town, the town of Silent Hill seamlessly with no loading screens. Here's the thing. Uh, besides the fact that, uh, there are barely any loading screens at all, and when they occur, they are only, uh about one second long and like this whole time we've been playing for hours we've only seen two and they lasted a second long um so they do not break the immersion at all really um it's just a footprint on the screen um let's read this first there's a piece of paper on the bed just some doodle huh something is written on it she is an angel. No one knows. Only I can see the lady of the door. They cannot walk along her bridge of thread. They fall from the weight of their crimes. Like bloated and ugly corpses. Their sin, she devours them. Sin and sinner alike. She saves me. She is an angel. Need some work. Um. Part of the horror. Whoa! Part of the horror comes from that. If I am able to explore the town seamlessly, that would not happen. Because, uh, you would be able to know. You'd be able to just push in a door and instantly know if an enemy is there. Of course, there could be jump scares. They could be quiet until they see you. It's not really the same. But every time I enter a door, I'm taking a gamble. Every time I click on a door, I'm taking a gamble. Because I don't know instantly if it's going to be the lock is broken or if it's going to open instantly. And if it opens instantly... Uh, then I go in, and I'm in the room, and I'm in the room with, with monsters, and I have to turn around, or maybe there's nothing in there. It's the surprise. That's the appeal. There's nothing appealing. This game would not be better if I was able to explore it seamlessly. It would be worse. That's part of the charm. Look at this painting. It's locked. And also, we were able to explore a downpour seamlessly. Pretty much, uh, was that a good game? Was it made any better by the fact that we could explore it seamlessly? No. There's a painting of a woman on the door. Oddly enough, the hand part of the painting is actually 3D and sticks out.
there are empty medicine bottles here. Is that what Maria was taking? Is Maria sick now too? Maria's not here. Where could she have gone? Nothing useful. Nothing useful yet. There's a shelf here. There are red handprints on the shelf. Move the shelf. One handed. James. Mary? Oh, Maria. It's you. I thought you were. Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. What do you mean, anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. Why didn't you try to save me? All you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I just... Then stay with me. Don't ever leave me alone. You're supposed to take care of me. <laughs> so, what about Laura? Did you find her? Yeah, but she ran away. We've got to find her. You really seem to care about her. Do you know her? I've never met her before. I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone. And for some reason, I feel like it's up to me to protect her. The basement's basement. Copper ring. Huh. 
Back to the day room. Park. On to question number two. Helen Hill witnessed a gruesome murder a few years back. A brother and sister were playing in the road when they were attacked and chopped into pieces with an axe. Torn flesh, smashed bones, splattered blood, and finally, bitter tears. What a terrible tragedy. He clearly said bitter what tears a there. Into such What was the name of the murderer who committed this vile act? One, Walter Sullivan. One, Walter Sullivan. Two, Scott Fairbanks. Three, Eric Gaines. Now for our third and final question. South of the lake is a deserted old neighborhood called South Vale. From there to Pale Vale, the central resort area northwest of the lake, there's only one road you can take. Just one road, no more. The third and final question is, what is the name of that road? One, Bachman Road. Two, Rindell Street. Three, Nathan Avenue. Well, that's the last of our questions. Have you got it all figured out? When you know the answers, head to the storeroom on the third floor to collect your prizes. But be careful if you're wrong. <laughs> well then, everybody, thanks for tuning in. See you again sometime. Bye-bye. What was that? <laughs> she doesn't react until the end. Uh, the last one? I mean... Yeah, it's gonna it's Nathan Avenue. So three one three. What about Rendell Street though? Can't open it? Yeah. Maria, give me a hand here. Come on. You're supposed to be the big man around here. How's a little girl like me supposed to help? <clears throat> What's this? Not very cute, is it? Here, James. 
You take it. Mm, thanks. <laughs> he sounds so flattered. Lead ring. There's nothing in the refrigerator anymore. A hideous smell is coming from inside. Uh, okay. Storeroom on the third floor? And we have to do this now before the next part, or we just won't get it. Aw, he did a cute little drawing of a fridge to remind himself about the fridge. Third floor storeroom. Yeah. There's a box. This wasn't there before. You know, the issue I have with this... Why doesn't it... <laughs> oh, Q1. Okay, so question one. It was 313. Three... Here we go. It's a whole bunch of stuff. the lead ring on the hand of the lady in the painting? Skull and spider. Is that what was on it? Looked like it. There's a note on the ground. The handwriting is hard to read. I took the director's key, the one to the museum. I hid it behind the praying woman when I went out for the day trip. I picked it up, but I did not steal it. I'm not a criminal. Get ready to run. Sorry, Maria, you're on your own. Oh, no, she's caught up. Open up!
Books about medicine, the town, and region are lined up here. I don't have the time to stand around reading all this. There's an old book here about the history of Silent Hill. He's not going to read it, though. He who is not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare into it himself. The truth can only be learned by marching forward. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. I copied them onto my map. I got the hospital lobby key. Bye. I think every door is locked. Got a double, triple check, of course. 